Hey, welcome to Stray Reviews. I'm Lee. And today marks the beginning of spring for me. Chelsea spring, I mean. Chelsea boots are the type of boot that I just can't seem to get enough of, especially casual Chelsea's. Maybe it's the easy on and off. Maybe it's the versatility, but Chelsea's just make me want to fill my whole closet with them. So I've got four, maybe more, but four Chelsea reviews that I'll be doing over the next few weeks. And they are going to be right around that $200 to $300 range. And we're kicking off this Chelsea Spring series with the Blake Chelsea by Rhodes Footwear. The Rhodes Blake is a casual boot. And the ones that I got here are a full grain rough out leather in taupe color. On the inside is a leather lining and a leather footbed. These come with a polyurethane outsole. It's got some cushion to it. It's got some durability, some slip resistance, and they're made with a recraftable welt. Though the Huckberry sales page doesn't use the word Goodyear welt like they do with their Jackson Chelsea, but they do say that they are recraftable. These boots are made in Leon, Mexico, and they source their leather from the Lafarque tannery. So what sets these Chelsea boots apart from all the others out there? We're going to get into it as we talk about the good, the bad, and the bottom line of the Rhodes Blake Chelsea boot. Hey, before we get started though, I make videos to help you make more informed decisions when you go to spend your hard earned dollar. And if that is something that you would like more of, I appreciate it if you tap that subscribe button and I hope it's helpful to you. All right, let's start with the good. And I think that the good is pretty obvious here. This is a great looking casual boot. They look great with jeans, chinos, khakis, whatever. And uh, the longer I own them, the more and more I find myself putting them on. The wedge sole almost has sort of a, a like a sneaker quality to it. And, uh, and I can dress them down more than I can dress down some other Chelsea's and even wear them with jeans and a t-shirt if I want. And you know how I'm always harping on the price of things? <laughs> well, I think that the Blake boot is actually kind of a decent value. It's something I don't say very often in reviews because I'm cheap, but at $198, the leather is nicer than any of the leathers I've actually seen on the recent Thursday boots, in my opinion. And I'm also getting something that's recraftable. Although I may be a bit biased because rough out leather is actually kind of my favorite leather. These boots are also comfortable and they break in pretty quickly. The pull tabs and the leather lining make them easy to pull on and off and the soles are easy on my feet. All in all, I really like the way they look, the way they feel, and the price tag. It's the trifecta. So what about the bad of the Rhodes Blake Chelsea boot? Well, I'll be honest with you. I have seen cleaner welting on boots before. Mine came with a skipped stitch and some fraying. However, it is important to keep into perspective that $198 for full grain leather that's recraftable. Yeah, I'm going to just let these minor issues slide. Also in the bad column are these polyurethane outsoles. They do help to make the Blakes more comfortable, but polyurethane are outsoles aren't really known for their heat tolerance. So if you're thinking about giving that campfire log a little kick to keep it burning, you should think again. Also, it's not a good idea to store polyurethane outsoles for long periods of time without being worn because they are prone to breaking down from hydrolysis. If I ever get these bad boys resold, I'll probably see if I can fit them with a pair of Vibram Christie outsoles because that would be awesome. The bottom line is that I like to wear these Blake Chelsea's. And in my opinion, the best boot is the one you'll wear, regardless of how much you paid for them. The Blakes are great looking, they're made of quality leather, and they're recraftable if these polyurethane soles 
ever go out on me. All in all, they're a great boot and I would definitely get them again. I want to thank Huckberry for providing these boots for review. These are my honest opinions as always. If you have experience with the Blake boot, would you drop me a comment down below? Thank you so much for watching. I hope this review was helpful. Feel free to check out my other review videos and we'll catch you next time.